In this video, we're going to be going through the Anovia V6 SOLIDWORKS integration and its access through the Windows Explorer client. To access it, you're basically going to look for the Anovia V6 access point and you're going to browse it just like conventional Windows folders inside of Windows Explorer. When we open up this particular folder structure, what we see is a split screen to the right and you browse everything just like green folders inside of Windows Explorer. Now these folders are created just like any normal folder and it shows up inside the Inovia V6 web client or when we create workspaces inside Inovia V6 they will show up inside of this client for SOLIDWORKS users. The files that are in here, the SOLIDWORKS files that are in here look just like a normal list of files and we can highlight them and perform actions like check out and check in. We can copy and paste or cut paste to different workspaces. We can look at the history of what happened to the file. But all of this is done inside the Windows Explorer client. We could double click on the files to open them up into SOLIDWORKS or look at properties on the files like uh, the description or part number. We could also look at the parent-child relationships of the files by selecting the contains tab down below and this will show you all the parts that are listed in the assembly including the quantity of those parts and the version of those parts and these kinds of links are related to the uh, configurations as well in the SOLIDWORKS assembly. If we look at the where used report it will show us all the uh, assemblies that where this part or assembly is used and we can look at various configurations of that particular uh, assembly as well.